Welcome to Call Center VoIP, center spelled C-N-T-R-E dot com and freepredictivedialers dot com. Uh, today we'd like to uh, discuss with you how to install um, a free G729 codec on your asterisk uh, boxes being Vichydal, Vichydal Now or Vichybox uh, server based systems for uh, your predictive dialer setup. A couple of things you will need. You'll need access to one of our website which is callcentervoip.com C-E-N-T-R-E voip.com. You will also need an FTP loader of some description, we use WinSCP. Uh, you'll need an SSH loader, which we use PuTTY. Um, you will also need your, um, your G729 Kodak. Okay, so to get started, the first thing you'll need to do is go to the Call Tech Center VoIP website and go to Predictive Dialer here, and you can see free G729 Kodak. So click on that. Uh, this is not associated to me, but this uh, guy has uh, done up a lot of resources to suit, as you can see, Asterix 1.4, 1.6, 1.2, 1.61, and just many, many computer based options of codecs. So, as I said, it's not associated to me, but I would uh, like uh, people to support him uh, by um, giving him a PayPal donation. First, one thing you need to know is uh, Asterix, uh, Vichybox and Vichydon now uses Asterix 1.2 based system. So these are all the different codes that are associated AMD based computers, Core 2 duos, uh, P4 based machines. Just to shortcut you a little bit, this codec here is for a Core 2. And this Kodak here would be for a uh, one uh, P4 based machine. As you can see, it says AST1212, meaning one, uh, Asterix 1.2. Here you see uh, that this is for Asterix 1.6. So from once you're in this site, find your Kodak that suits your machine. Click on it. I'm on a uh, Core 2 based machine, so you go and save that. And uh, pretty much from there, you're ready to start the load. So. First thing you need is uh, WinSCP to log in and load the dialer. Um, just obviously get your IP address. You'll need your root username and password. Um, and log into your uh, FTP. A um, couple of things, here's a shortcut here of where we have to go to um, load your dialer. So on your dialer side, um, you have to go to user, then lib. This will actually take a few minutes to load because I'm on remote. Okay, now we're... Uh, have logged into user lib then asterisk then we go and find modules sorry we log into asterisk then we find modules then you just track down where your um, G729 is located Okay, once you've uh, in your um, user lib asterisk and modules area and you've found your uh, codec, you copy that directly over. And basically, once that's on, we're ready to set up. While that's happening, open up your putty. Log in. Okay. Okay, now we're in. Okay, so from your party, you've got to go to your asterisk area, so asterisk, space R.
sorry, I meant asterisk space minus R. Term you need to do is load LOAD space. Go back to your Kodak. Just get the file name for it. Spa uh, just uh, copy that in there. Push enter. And as you can see, it'll come up with this code here: G7292LIN and LIN TOG G7729. Uh, if you compare that to my notes. Um, that is the code that will mean the G729 free is registered and is ready to use. I've used this for some time. It uh, is quite powerful and I really don't have an issue. So I highly recommend uh, you try that uh, out and get your Vichy box up and running. And you should be able to make calls with watching a couple more videos. Before I finish off tonight, I'd like to announce that Call Centre VoIP is a, uh, a world uh, VoIP provider to call centre based traffic. Um, very simple procedures. Um, to sign up for a test account, you click sign up now, fill in the details. VoIP service, sorry. You fill in the details underneath the application form. Alright, there's a big breakdown between uh, just buying VoIP and also being able to use our hosted Vichy dial based systems which is also available from our websites um, on freepredictivedialers.com and hosted-predictive-dialers.com you can get a hosted system directly from us uh, we do offer free services once you sign up for it you just go and buy whatever credit you want you can get a test uh, VoIP account for two dollars and uh, basically that's it from that point you are ready to make phone calls from the next demonstration which should be um, setting up your agent and trunk and users. We thank you very much for your time and uh, we hope you appreciate that information. Please leave a, uh, a note.